Late Wednesday afternoon, Elon Musk revealed phase two of Tesla's master plan. And if you were scratching your head saying, I didn't know they had a plan one, you are not alone. Uh, it's been around for actually about 10 years and lives on Tesla's website. But here's what plan one was. Step one, build a super expensive, low volume electric car. They did that with the Roadster. Step two is use the proceeds from the Roadster to build a more affordable family style car did that with the Model S. And the third step in Tesla's phase one master plan was to build a way more affordable mass transit car for everyone. And Tesla is doing that with the Model 3. So now it is time for phase two. And if you don't know, Tesla's goal has always been to promote sustainable fuel, not necessarily to always make money and people buy their own Teslas. That's why they release all of their patents publicly. So the goal with phase two is to address all the different modes of terrestrial transportation, as Elon Musk put it, and holy crap did they do it so here's what to expect from Tesla's phase two master plans first the solar city merger makes a lot more sense Elon wants beautiful solar roofs on all houses presumably connected to Tesla battery packs on the car side that's where things got interesting not surprisingly more body styles based on the model 3 architecture so we'll see a crossover SUV and we'll see a new type of pickup truck don't know what that means but pickup truck powered by electricity coming soon. Elon then went on to address other modes of mass transportation, things like buses. There'll be a Tesla bus and there'll also be a Tesla big rig, both of which are expected to make their debut sometime next year, at least in design form and hit the road sometime in the next three to four years. And speaking of the next three to four years, that is when Elon Musk claims cars will be fully autonomous, meaning you can just go to sleep in the back. And Tesla's got some plans for full autonomy. Essentially, if you want a car to come pick you up, you open up a Tesla app and one of Tesla's own fleet of cars will just drive up, pick you up, take you where you want to go. If you are a Tesla owner and you want to make some money from your car, you can actually let your car join that pool. So while you're at work, your car can just be its own Uber and pick people up and come back and you can make some money from it. I don't know how I personally feel about, say, put someone else sitting in my car and how they would treat it but it's an option to make some money now from your automobile. Elon claimed people only driving their cars about 10 to 12% of the time and the rest of it just kind of sitting there doing nothing. So a ton of Tesla news. As a huge fan of electric transport and as a huge fan of Tesla in general, I am super excited. What do you guys think about phase two? Are you interested in any of this? It's fascinating to see, even if you're not a fan of Tesla or a fan of Musk, uh, the sort of fan of Musk, fan of my own Musk. Uh, to start to see the electric transport gain more and more footing uh, is just really cool to sort of be a part of that kind of revolution. Anyway, guys, let me know. Leave the comments down below. Mash that thumbs up button. We appreciate it. John Render, Techno Buffalo. See you guys in the next one.